Welcome to another week of Tony Wolf Remembers Tri-State Wrestling here from the Roving Wolf Den. And uh, this week we're going to be jumping around a couple different areas. We've got a show from the Fairmont Mall in Fairmont, West Virginia. It's Mason Hunter versus a local talent by the name of Magnum. Y'all will recognize the name Magnum because him and Rocky Reynolds went to TNA in um, Tennessee, Nashville, for their weekly TV tapings and really impressed some people. So take a watch at these two guys in action, and I'll see you on the other side. Fine young wrestler, Mason Hunter. The young man's held many titles around the Northeast United States. Very fine athlete. Has a very good amateur background. With a martial arts background, which which will become evident here in a little bit. And we could just find out who controls the volume to this music when they come in and Not have music. that person shot. They play music? It's too loud. What's too loud? Never mind. His opponent's probably coming out now. They've started the music again. Hey. What do you think, Harvey? Maybe there's going to be another wrestler walk out. Could be. Pee Wee Sherman, the man in the ring. A graduate of Sam Houston Institute of Technology. I've seen him before. This would be Magnum. This, this should be a very exciting match. It very well should be exciting. It ought to be exciting. It's the main event. Mason pointing to the belt, thinking it should be around his waist. And that's what this is all about tonight, Harvey, giving him the opportunity to put it around his waist. <coughs> Is supposed to do, Harvey. Yes, it is. So we're looking at this sure action for the. Pee not an imposter. That's Pee Wee. This is the NWA West Virginia Ohio title match. Magnum carrying the belt to the ring. We'll see who carries it out. A little reversal of arm arm twists. We'll go to the old-fashioned hammerlock. All right. There's nice. your amateur background, Harvey. Nice move by Mason Hunter. Mason got an arm bar on his opponent now. A move that applied that improperly can cripple a man. Oh. Nice reversal there by both men. Mm, the little bus from the Sharp Hospital just got here with a bunch of waters. Break the eyes by Mason Hunter. I think we're going to see the dark side of Mason Hunter in this match, Harvey. Yes, I think you're right. Ah, three reversals, four reversals. And a partridge in a pear tree. Uh, uh, nice, very nice. Into a pinning predicament. Pee Wee's asleep. All right. You sure it's Pee Wee? Hmm? You sure it's Pee Wee? It's Pee Wee.
the creativity of the crowd astounds me. Yes. Yeah. What? A real test of strength would be if they both smack Pee Wee and he tells us who hits the hardest. Now that is a test of strength. Is Thomas Edison in this match? No. Why do they keep saying what? They can't think of anything else to say. They've no. seen television shows once too often. Mm. How hot was it? Very. Very. Mm. Test of strength. All right. Mason seems to be winning at this point. Oh. That was quick. Yes, it was. Magnum a lot stronger than uh, Mason Hunter thought. And same reaction there. Both gentlemen very strong. They both look like they went to the Arthur Murray School of Dancing. Whoa. They? They're both well-conditioned athletes. Look at that. You don't yes, see any excess uh, jelly on these gentlemen. There's no wasted energy either. No, there isn't. They know what they're doing. Thomas Edison not here? No. You, you may not realize, Harvey, but Steve Austin has been doing that yeah. lately. Yeah. And it has nothing to do with Thomas Edison. It has well, nothing to do Steve with Austin. the wattage of the radio I station see. promoting this. He looks like Steve Austin. Uh, no, he doesn't. Austin doesn't have here either. No, but there's a difference. What? What? Now don't you start that. All right, locked up. Ooh. Oh, and there God. goes... Wrestling holds, Harvey. It's a yeah. beautiful thing to watch. So we had the privilege of watching uh, Mason Hunter wrestle Gary Steele recently. Yes. Quite a good match. A real professional wrestling match. Yes, it was. I and think this one's going to be a, about the same A way. lot of wrestling holds. A lot of give and take. A lot of reversals. A lot and, of And you know what impressed me match. the most? What was they that, They shook Harvey? hands after the match. Yes, they did. There was no, no animosity, no anger between them. Two men working for a paycheck. They're just yep. doing their job as best they can. <laughs> Poor Pee Wee getting abused. Whoa! Oh. Oh. Yes, we are seeing Mason Hunter's dark side, Harvey. Yeah. My, that even Can hurt. it get much darker? That even hurt me. And I was just watching. Yes, you were. Oh, my. Beautiful. Wrestling at its finest. Yeah. Oh, my. Now, this is the kind of a match that you sit through the whole show to see. The yes, main event. Do. feel like I'm in a jungle. Except there's no kookaburra bird here. You feel better now? Oh, yes. I can you know the more I look at it, that guy does look like Steve Austin. No, he doesn't. You don't think so? I mean the one that was a six a million dollar man. He's a bald white guy. Trading kicks to the ribs. Magnum, Magnum I think, came out ahead on that. Taking the advantage. What? One says, huh? One says, what? Pee Wee's <laughs> out of the ring doing the counting. I'm glad there's no parrots in a pet shop down here. Is there a pet shop down here? I don't think. We've got ho dogs, though. Yeah. <laughs> Dave's famous TNL ho dogs. <laughs> it just doesn't get any more exciting than this, does it? No, it doesn't. Not unless we have midget wrestlers or mud wrestling. I think we did in the tag team match. No, there was only one midget in the hand. Oh. All right. What's he? Is he? Oh. 
Couldn't get him up for the suplex. And he goes, drops him, and goes for the pinfall. Mason doesn't get it. Thought for a minute we were going to see a variation of the old Tully Blanchard slingshot suplex. Oh, that one he got. That one, yeah. He hit that beautifully. Mason Hunter making the mistake many wrestlers do, Harvey. He's talking to the crowd, not concentrating on the opponent. Yeah, once you lose that concentration, you're in for a thumping. Once you lose your concentration, you're distracted. Yes, you are. Huh? Well, there's a surprise. Whoa. Missed him. Now he missed him. Oh, didn't miss him that time. Missed him, missed him. Now you got to kiss him. Oh. You're starting to worry me. No, I'm not. All Keep right, we got uh, we got Magnum on the outside on the floor. Mason chased him over there, slams his head viciously into the ring. Ooh, evil chop to the chest. Another one. Oh, you can hear that all the way over here. Oh. The, the chops against Mason's chest because Mason wrestling without a shirt. Much more auditory. Louder. Acoustically, w. yes. Yes, vibrant. He is like a resonant chamber. Yes, he is. As opposed to a gas chamber. Having soap. Pee Wee Sherman in the ring. Mason Hunter in the ring. Magnum trying to get to his feet so he can get in the ring. Pee Wee going through puberty again. Pee-wee's Pee been through puberty three times. He just keeps regressing back into it. Oh, oh my. my. I don't know if there was a name for that other than ew. That's called mistake. Good golly, Miss Molly, that had to He hurt. had his head Ooh. in the wrong place. Uh-huh. Like the old serials used to be on TV. You remember those? Can no, this my, be the end of our hero? No, my, I always had to eat my cereal in the kitchen. All right, look at him up there. Look at that. Oh, my. Oh. Both men down. Remind me, I'll tell you about a serial killer. Two later. and all right. Oh, that's right, Pee Wee. Two count. I bet you two. ate Cheerios and tried to sink them. Okay. Mason struggling to his feet. Magnum up. Magnum in control right now. S says he's going to take Mason up. Oh, my. F nice bridge two count, by Mason Pee Hunter. Pee Wee gave us a two count, Harvey. Did you have uh, Cheerios and tried to spell words with them? All I ever spelled was ooh. Okay. I'm just checking. Mm -hmm. But I always kept a couple Cheerios in my pocket for playing Scrabble. They had that one. <laughs> they had that one kind of cereal out where you ate the box and all. I forget what it was, though. All right, Mason up in the air. You see the TNL Ho Dog sign. Dave's famous TNL Ho Dogs. Up in the air. Is he going to make it? No, he didn't make it in time. Oh. Magnum recuperates himself and comes up and knocks Magna, or knocks Mason off that perch. Big, big shot to the chin of Mason Hunter. Look now, Harvey. Can he pull Mason off there? Can he pull him off? Oh, oh, he did. That was sort of a modified DDT. Yeah. I think Mace is two inches shorter from that. Two count. Mm. Tell you, this match, very, very much give and take. Right now, Mason doing the taking and Either man Magnum could win. doing the giving. Is that what you're saying? Either man could win this match? That's entirely possible. Or they could both be disqualified. One never knows. Oh, someone will win this, man. All right. It looks like he knows what he wants to do here. Oh, and that I wasn't it. No, I don't think it was. Both men down, Harvey. And they're both Magnum trying to get to his pain. feet. Or writhing, as the writhing, case may be. Yeah, you say data, I say data. You say tomato, I say potato. You say baked, I say fried. 
You say cantaloupes, I say windshield wipers. You say cantaloupes, I say headlights. All right, look at that. Magnum into the corner. No, kicks big, big kicks Mason stomach. as he came after him. Oh. Oh, my. No, he kicked out. Slam well, the title's the, not going to change unless you really pin the man. Oh, Mason said that's it. Mason determined now to take this title. Reversal. Oh, Reversal. One, two, and three. That's There's it. your victory. Magnum retains his NWA Ohio West Virginia heavyweight title. And still. That's it. The title stays with the champion. It's been another great night of pro wrestling. I'm Mark Mills along with... Well, every time I do one of these shows, I keep talking about this crazy tag team called Gay. Well, this, this week, I'm going to show you a match. Team Gay in a three-way match, which you can just about imagine. It was at a bar show the, in Fairmont, West Virginia. Against Cole Cash, Chris Kahn, and then the third team was El Fandango and DJ Skittles. This is priceless.
hope you all enjoyed that match. Um, on the next match, we're going to have a young up-and-comer at the time. He was training with me as a referee. He was very young at the time and was just starting to break in as a wrestler. But from the first time we saw him, we were like, he's a small version of AJ. We thought, this is a small version of AJ Styles. So we referred to him as the phenom, Zach Vincent. And he'll be taking on another tri-state regular of Violent Vance Desmond. These two were luchador high flyers, but Vance knew how to ground and pound at the same time. So enjoy this match.
As you can see, that was another wild match. This is a wrap for this show. Hope you all enjoyed everything. If you haven't already, please sign up. Give me a thumbs up. Leave your comments in the comment section below. And keep your eyes open for Tony Wolf Remembers Tri-State Wrestling because you never know what I'm going to dig out of my vault next time. See you at ringside.